Hello everyone, my name is Dromat and today we're going to do a Tlia Meat Guide on Grandmaster at around 300 LP. I think I lost a lot this weekend. And we're going to try to have the most positive and happy experience in solo queue that we could possibly achieve by playing good and disabling chat, which we did. And focusing on the Yone matchup because it's very difficult to play against the Yone and the Kha'Zix properly. Basically, if you don't count the Zillian, they are full AD. And oh yeah, I do have. I'm gonna mute the chat now because I want to focus. So if someone gets pissed. And yeah, the tactic is good. If you say you want to play around your jungler, you're doing your job right on mid generally, especially if you have a jungler that is early oriented and now the jungle has been changed to be early oriented of sorts also i could probably go this game forever frost because of this item specifically kindle gem into yone it's an actually best in slot buy if you don't go for seekers but i have to go for seekers so uh, i will go for seekers first and i will also uh, maybe pink tabbies I will go for Seekers into something like Lyandry simply because it offers me uh, a lot more damage than, well, or maybe maybe we're doing uh, Ludens, but we'll see. Also, I'm playing with Electrocute, Test of Blood, Eyeball Collection, Ravenous Hunter, Cup the Grace, Prince of Mind, and these rune stats. I don't know why those two are switched. And I see here the Yone, he's playing with Magic Resist, obviously, and I really, really hope that my team will go for a lot of oh my god that was bad i really hope my team would go for a lot of armor strictly because zilan doesn't really deal that much ap now till six my goal is to help jarvan and not die post six my goal is to survive the yone ult and that will come with the help of the seekers and that will also help me against kazix so okay so he went Okay, I hit him. He went for uh, probably W second. And he plays with the healing rune. Which will just keep him alive a lot. So we can't really... Can't really do much, but we can push. Gonna do that E there, so we... So we gonna slightly move the lane towards his tower. I want to help do this strictly because I want to actually help Jarvan at the scuttle. Because now it's going, there is going to be a scuttle fight right now. So I'm going here, I'm gonna work deeper, and I'm gonna ping as usual on the other side of the map. Because uh, most likely there is a Kha'Zix around. So I didn't lose much CS, maybe. Oh. I didn't lose at all CS. Yeah, so likely. Likely Kha'Zix is there, exactly. Because why is that? Why did I ping there? And look, they, they both used flash. Uh, why did I ping that Kha'Zix is there? Because we've seen Jarvan here and we noticed in time that uh, we... Well... Okay, we push him away. If you notice that Jarvan is not getting attacked by anyone at that scuttle, it's obvious that they are on the other side of the map at the other scuttle. And now we just went scuttle to scuttle at the cost of bot lane's flash. Man, I'm so technical in this. And I think... Kaiser loses here because Kazix will. Oh, do we win this? Oh! Okay, go, go, go. Seraphine? Hello? Okay, let's, let's push this. This needs to be pushed regardless of what we do. Okay. Good. And I'm playing with the Jarvan. As you can see, I'm here because Jarvan went here. I don't really lose. Okay. Okay, guys, are going there. I'm going to push this another wave. I think I could go for a plate. I think Kaiser is getting the cannon, which is great. I would have got two. But if I get here this plate, this is actually massive for me. Nice. I could go straight for Seekers now into the recall. I don't have CS advantage, not level advantage either. But I could just go for Seekers first. And Seekers into this game, guys, is auto win if you are having a sort of even, sort of even match. And that's because they have Kha'Zix, they have Yone. These guys deal a lot of AD damage. They hate armor, right? Especially till Yone goes for Infinity Edge and then it's painful. 
And so, oh boy, Kaisa has no idea that a wave must not be pushed like this, it seems. And I am behind in level, but I'm going to do a full combo here strictly because... Oh, nice. Okay, I pushed it, I hit that, I back off because there is a Kha'Zix who's going to hunt me. We are behind in CS, we see that minions. And he's going to make 6 soon, I'm going towards somewhere like here. I cannot go any other way because he's 6 now and I have to flash it, I have to react in time. Uh, I will not die from his ult, but I will die from the follow up, right? Because there will be follow up. So one out attack, two out attacks, three out attacks. I'm also playing with that attack speed rune, which helps us a lot. So, uh, eh, got that. While I am behind a bit, it's fine because I had in time the seekers. So that just bought me whatever I needed to survive. And if you look over the seekers, we can see that it gives about 60 armor now with the 15 that we have and I could go here I could do a full Q okay two full Qs they don't have time to react to this and we smited it we cannot kill Yone you shouldn't go there I'm thinking because Yone could just ult him and he's be he's done he's really done one, two, one, two, one, two. Jarvan jumped onto the guy here. You should, you're dead here. If Yone came. And I need to push this in like this. There was a minion under that. I need to push this in because Yone will come and will want to shove it in so I don't have time to recall. Please, please. Okay, we are fine, you're fine careful I'm backing off I'm pinging a lot and it might be annoying but to be fair okay so this is a very bad this is a very bad dive Yoni is also coming Yoni is also coming Nah, I think a lot of people will die here because Yoni is also there and okay we have Diego okay that changes it that changes it I'm far away I'm ulting here regardless because Diego is Diego and he will do Viego stuff. Go, go, go. I flashed badly. Catch him. Alt, alt, you have alt. Auto attack, nice. Man, that flash was bad. I really wanted to get more there. And we could help this wave. Well, we shouldn't have won that. We shouldn't, definitely shouldn't have won that. And I say that because Kazix, if Kazix were here. It would have been a free win, but for some reason he was on top side. What are you doing? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. No, I understand what you're doing. Yeah, we could we could snipe Kazix. Back off. We should have waited for Kazix, but we did get did get half HP. Seraphine had ult. But that was very ballsy. So, right now, I'm sorry to say, but we're not winning. Uh, we're not winning because we're better, necessarily, mechanically. We're winning strictly because Kha'Zix was top. And, okay, I need to back off. Kha'Zix being top there actually cost them the whole fight. Because Viego is Viego. He will do that, what he just did there. And I wasted flash for no reason, I cast it all. I, I tried to win there as fast as I could. And man, that's stupid. Man, that's stupid. Okay. I cannot, I cannot help you anymore. Viego inted that one. Not only he did a good play there, but now he inted hard. And I have to recall and he will get plates. this okay well <laughs> you know he did a good action then a very bad action I could 
just auto attack him to death. Proc the potion. I'm not able to recall because, as you can see, uh, via, uh, Yone does his thing. Haven't really been impactful at all. Okay. One tower shot. Auto attacks. And proc the potion. Be careful, auto attack, auto attack. Don't recall in a bad spot. I'm not sure what they did on top again. Come, 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 come. I need I need some retribution here. Okay, we win also, but what? Zillian didn't cast alt. Okay, I'm not doing anything this game besides surviving. And honestly, they should have won at that fight on bot. So I'm just chilling now. Okay, we have a full combo from the guy. And we win strictly because uh, I have Seekers. Guys, guys, Seekers, <laughs> this is what winning games. Okay, and run away, run away, nice, yeah, I'm gonna go for more armor. And now top lane wins as well, I'm going for more armor here, I don't care. I'm going for that, so I'm going for Ludens this game. Um, strictly because well this is bad shouldn't have gone for this but actually uh, I'm, I'm undecided honestly because I won't be the guy who deal damage we have three other damage dealers who are very much ahead I could ping uh, I could ping that we should kill Yone okay Well, that's good enough for me. Well, I'm not sure why is this so easy. Really, I haven't... I don't deserve this, guys. I feel bad because I had much better games today and I hate that I would <laughs> I would have been dead anyway I wouldn't have lived there okay so uh, this armor thingy could be boots could be sword shoes that's stupid that's very stupid yeah because he could have lived but we do have the Seraphine. Man, stop. Questionable. Really questionable. Amount of greed there. Okay, and now he kills everyone. Because <laughs> it's a broken champion. Now they will kite back. Okay. This champion is stupid, and I love it. <laughs> it's because it's in our team. <laughs> but Jarvan did that bit of ints there. And it's also confusing for Viego. Having a Viego is very confusing. Ah, uh, man. Let's just push this in. Yeah, I don't know where Kha'Zix went at that action, to be honest. I really don't know. Okay, let's get this tower, moving bot. And I could probably stay for a small trick here. Hello, my man. <laughs> I'm going to take this blue. Man, I love this. I love Jonas that gets met with the seekers. I get met, that's bad English. I love when I meet people with the Seekers and make them like, boop, you cannot kill me anymore, it's not so simple. And I really love the low gold price of it. Okay. 
gonna probably meet the Kha'Zix here and I will not beat the Kha'Zix because he has ulti so I'm just gonna do a full combo push it in and do another Q here and run away oh, okay stop side never mind never mind hello Galista what are you doing there hopefully I dropped okay this is for me Definitely for me. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> gotcha stuff! And Diego is about to die. That was... That was something. We do outscale them greatly. And so... Okay, I could go for Landry. And so I don't really care. I have 100 armor. That's more than enough to repel them, so to say this is again a very bad call strictly because Kha'Zix is around and we do have vision but if they just come there yikes but it's fine we have overfed Viego I'm doing pretty fine for myself too getting this wave here missing some CS as usual gonna cast the W onto that so we don't lose that much okay now, let's see where he bats to. He bats to here. You should be careful. I should be careful. Oh my god, I got so scared there. I hate this champion. I cannot... Ah. I thought he was roaming mid, so I inted bot. That's why I... <sighs> but this is so silver, man. And it's also funny, this, this item offers so much counterplay to any AP mage, to anything. It offers so much counterplay against any AP mage. Man, 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 man. Uh, well, 0, 0.7. I guess that's where our, their deaths are. So, man, what's that damage? What's that damage, man? You're not gonna win if that happens. Got him. Drake. Drake, we win by Drake's because Kalista is very tilted. I hate though, I did not have that much impact. Okay. Pop it up. Push it one more. Oh, good. Okay, seeing that. Okay, that's two. The teleport came in smoothly. Really countered anything they could have mustered there. And I don't think Viego can win that one. Okay, he could have, he could have won that if. Man, this guy. I mean, plays like he's invincible. And in reality, well, we got this as well. I could get rights. Definitely. So this is mine. Let's get some level advantage. And I flashed in time the Kha'Zix and the armor, man. The armor is insane against Kha'Zix. I love when I have dual assassin and jungler AD in the enemy team because I can just make that and be done with it, be happy with it. I just... I missed that, obviously. Obviously. Are you coming? Yeah, no, he's going to back off. I'm gonna get one more wave. I'm gonna get one more wave here. Oh, I'm actually going for the blue. Blue into Zonia, Sokshu, something. That would be the logic there. Boop, boop, 
that and I fear that if I recall now ah, but there is a huge wave on bots I want this is just some dead time which we could counter simply by going bot and pushing now there is a possibility of a Kha'Zix but I doubt he's going to be that resourceful in thinking because I'm not going to okay I see him on top now Yone is going to come here so that's why I'm just recalling so just 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 wait, wait me just wait me because now I could just go for this I'm gonna make armor boots for the sake of it two vision words and I'm practically invincible at this point 133 armor I think I have more armor than my top laner okay close to the Jarvan close to the top laner for a uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna cast ult here so that we block them. See, Kazix was blocked. Kazix was blocked there. I have Zonia. I'm gonna Zonia. I'm getting out of this. Okay, it's fine. Viego is in the middle of the fight. Okay, we can just get the guy. He didn't have time to restack it. I see Kalista is on the top side. I think she recalled. I'm going after her. Exactly. She didn't have time to recall. I knew she didn't have time to recall there. And look! It's the Zonia, guys. I was in the middle of the entire thing. I was just spreading damage left and right. Could have probably gone mid too, but... I think it's over. I think we won this by this fight. And honestly, I think I played it good. Even though I got hit by the Yone, I played it... Decently well by zoning in time, pressing E, dodging the Kalista, and focusing onto the Kled. It was winnable before, but the ult just kept Kha'Zix from reaching it in time. So, remember guys, that's very important. So, uh, what I did right in this game, maybe I did not... Uh, well, I pinged that Yone was going to roam when I was base. I tried to follow, I flashed for no reason and ulted there for no reason, because Viego countered the bot lane gank. So he did better for us. So Viego practically won the early fight, which gave us a lot of room for advancement. Then I inted one more time against um, the Yone, one versus one, which I always kind of do because I never remember to play it safe. I have 300 LP now. Uh, I did play bad, as you can see. Uh, I lost a lot of games uh, this weekend. But then again, damage-wise... I've done my part, I dealt similar to Yone, but the part that was important here was to not die. Because Yone died six times, I, I died twice, and I was against the Yone and the Kha'Zix, and the Zilan, and the Kled. One that was impossible to escape, even though I wasted Flash, the other that was uh, my mistake, because I thought Yone runs, but I know, I know he waits for me, it's so simple to wait as an assassin, sort of, to wait for the enemy. So that was the game, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it and see you next time in the True Math channel. Let's hope we reach challenges soon. I hope so because I tilted very hard this weekend. So we could take a bit, take a breath, chill, mind our mistakes, learn from them, and win the game. Thank you guys for watching all of my videos you've watched. It means a lot to me. And. Again, any questions on Discord, they're here, we're going to try to answer them, and I'm really glad I have such an amazing community, guys, here. Thank you, and see you next time. Bye-bye.